So here I am drinking coffee with Osa. How are you doing, Osa? Fine. Yeah. Was the food good? Yes. Great. Yes. On a scale from one to five, the five being the best. Four. Oh, thank you. episode how do you do into welcome to stories of my life so today wednesday third day i guess after my operation i'm a little bit swollen i had some not pain when i woke up and i'm taking painkillers now it's almost 24 hours since i ate because of scheduling conflicts yesterday so now today <laughs> I'm going to, my friend Orsa is coming for a visit and lunch. So I'm going to go out and buy something to make lunch with. Because I haven't got a thing to make lunch with. Out of. I don't know. And after that, in the evening, I'm going to go see a show with Teater Tillsammans. Uh, Jobbet framförallt. Work above all else. I think that's the day. Of course, there will be some cleaning before she comes. She, she'll be coming in two hours. So I've been shopping and I think it will be my version of, damn it, I forgot to buy the burgers. <laughs> so <laughs> it could have been my version of just bread and vegetables and sauce dressing with no burgers. <sighs> I had an operation. Well, it's really going to be my version because I did not buy vegan hamburgers. I bought vegan schnitzel and vegan some sort of supposed to taste like chicken, I guess. Sort of patties. Exciting. Yeah. I think that's my middle name. It should be. You are Kim Exciting Clifton Bergman. Yeah. Maybe beautiful will also fit in there. No, the beauty. Yeah. So Orsa just called, called? No, she texted and said she'd be five, 15 minutes late. And I think, yeah, that's right on brand. Uh, so I had some yogurt and then I had a hot dog while waiting because it's past 12 o'clock so I can eat. So I will eat. I have eaten. That's what's happening right now. Hello. So here I am drinking coffee with Orsa. How are you doing, Orsa? Fine. Yeah? Was the food good? Yes. Great? Yes. On a scale from one to five, the five being the best. Four. Oh, thank you. Orsa and I, we are going for a walk and a talk. Where are we going to go? I think we need to go, because we've been talking about water towers. So I think we need to go to water tower. Okay. So it's straight over here, up that hill, over that bridge, and then we are with the water tower. No. Yes? <laughs> no. <laughs> we are now high, high, high up. Orsa is enjoying the view. Yes. Yes. Can you say something else about the view? No. <laughs> so she's very good on social media. <laughs> gentlemen also says goodbye she's taking the bus i'm not taking the bus i'm going to get on my bike and go into the city but not now for a couple of hours oh she was almost killed by that cyclist oh damn living dangerously also says goodbye and walks away so i've known also for an awfully long time we used to go to gay discos she was sort of like my fag hag in the olden days uh, and then she's sort of, oh, oh, two doves fighting in a tree. <gasps> Is that an omen? Uh, anyway, uh, we used to go to get disco. So then she moved from Stockholm and then she sort of met a guy and got a kid and we sort of drifted apart. And now she sort of reached out to me. Uh, well, we met she thought, last summer and then, well, once, twice a year then we meet and talk. And talk and talk and talk and nothing really comes of it, but we just talk. And she says, you, you, you should do this. And I say, I can't remember that. Was that me? Was that us? I don't remember that. It's time to get on my bike and go into the city to see a little show in an hour. So join me as I go to the theatre for once. And also you might look here 
at my other account, because uh, there I'll be speaking Swedish and be tremendously entertaining for those who understand it, and it's confusing as fuck for those who don't. Get in sight. And we're on the bottom floor. over it was kind of it was good it's the visuals was really good this sort of set design and the costumes uh, and the sort of the way they solve problems good but there was something off I don't know what maybe it is that they sort of acted it's a very I don't know the word. The play is very sort of distant, and they're acting very distant as well. So to sort of, so you don't really get into it. So I find myself sort of going, hmm, oh, I haven't been listening. Oh, they've been talking. I haven't been listening because it's so, it's distant. The word, the word, I'm, it is, in Swedish, it's the word distanced. But it's sort of like the, it's not unreal. It's a very sort of surreal, surreal play, and they act surreal as well. And that, for me, doesn't quite work. If it's unreal, you sort of have to be real in it. Or if it's a real play, you can act unrealistic in it. But now when you do both, it's sort of like, huh? Hmm. I don't know what they're trying to say. So. I've been buying some pitted, no, I've been buying some frozen peas because I'm going to make some guacamole. And ahead of me in the queue was an old man, really old man. He was buying, he had bought pitted olives and found a pit in one of the olives. And he was really humble and just saying sort of, I have, I'm, I have these bad teeth and it could be really dangerous and we need to talk. And they were really nice to him as well and he said well there could be other people who got pitted you know got pits and they're um, supposedly pitted olives and so it could be dangerous and they sort of like they really helped him yes you need to call this number and it was really heartwarming to see because he I guess he was kind of lonely as well but thought of he, he had he had the pit with him he showed them showed them the pit and he had the jar and he had the, the receipt and he told me so he, he could he had sort of he hurt his teeth it wasn't sort of he, not, not, not much but he sort of bit into it and it sort of hurt him slightly but someone else could hurt himself really him or herself really really so, so it's really 
it was like a beautiful sort of love scene somehow that's all we are in the church and this is the grave of one of our first king Gustav Vasa and this is a woman I thought she was real I <laughs> she looks so real Thank you for watching and for liking, commenting, subscribing and following. It really helps and uh, something to do with the internet and the algorithm, I think. So thank you so much.